Bill. Number eight Tennessee's eight game win streak versus unranked teams was snapped with last week's loss to Arkansas and the Vols got off to a slow start again. Nico Iamaleava struggled in the first half didn't get much help from his offensive line. The quarterback had a fumble sacked three times for a loss of 19 total yards and threw an interception. Vols down three nothing at halftime and held scoreless in the first half for the second straight game. What in the name of Josh Heupel is going on out here? As for Florida's quarterback, mid-third, Graham Mertz. Short pass to Arliss Boardingham, and he's in for the touchdown. Florida up 10-0. After the play, Mertz limping off the field. Shuffles, appears to step awkwardly, and immediately goes down here. Has to limp off the field, slams down his helmet. He's frustrated, grabs his left leg, goes into the tent. He would not return. Ensuing Tennessee drive going for it on fourth and one handoff to Dylan Sampson into the checkerboard end zone Tennessee down 10 7 first point scored since the third quarter of week six against Arkansas next drive DJ Lagway in a quarterback for Florida first play interception to Arion Carter the pick led to a Tennessee field goal to tie the game at 10 oh man mistakes I gotta be better than that few minutes into the fourth tied at 10 Tennessee football handoff to Samson finds a seam 23 yards into the end zone second touchdown of the game the Vols have scored 17 straight points they're up 17 to 10 Mertz on the sideline on crutches getting hugs from his coaches and teammates the game's in the hands of the freshman DJ Lagway 40 seconds left in the fourth clock rolling Gators down seven third and 18 Lagway Fires a dart to Chimray DK. Touchdown Gators. Chomp, chomp. We're tied at 17. His first passing touchdown since week three. We are going to overtime. Tennessee wins the toss. Elects to start on defense. Florida doesn't get in the end zone. They're trying to get a field goal here. Trey Smack from 47 yards out. He smacks it. And it's no good. Oh. Three for four in his career on game tie or go ahead field goals in the fourth quarter overtime, but he misses here. Tennessee now wins with a score. Sampson, he's in. Tennessee completes the comeback to win at 23 17 in overtime. Their first overtime win against Florida since 1998. But the Vols need to clean some things up, taking on Alabama next week.